Hi friends! In this video, we'll give you a quick overview of each of the places we stayed at on our two-week trip from Toronto to Caspé, Quebec. Our first night we spent at the end of this road in Pickering, Ontario, not far from the nuclear power generating station. It was perfect for us as we took our bikes out the next morning and were right at the Great Lakes Waterfront Trail. In Kingston, we stayed at this parking lot right on the water. It's free after 6 p.m. until 8 the next morning. The next night, we stayed in the parking lot of the Cooper Marsh Conservation Area. A great spot if you want to take a walk in the marsh in the morning. We found this neighborhood park on our first night in Quebec. It's right on the St. Lawrence River. Our next night we pulled into this rest area along Route 132. Many Walmarts allow overnight parking, so in Campbellton, we headed over to this one. As far as Walmarts go, this was one of the prettiest backdrops we've seen. This area is a campground in the summertime, but all closed up for the season in October. Free parking overnight would not be an option when the campground is open, though. In Gas Bay, this ski resort is kind enough to allow campers to stay overnight during the off-season. It was a popular spot, with many other campers here as well. We had stayed at this rest area on a previous road trip, so we knew what to expect. The seals close by were an extra treat at this stop. This spot was the closest to the side of the road that we stayed at on this trip. The traffic calmed down later in the evening, so we got a good sleep and got an early start the next morning. This park had spots dedicated to overnight campers. Thank you to the city of Ramuski. We enjoyed exploring this town the next day. As you get closer to big cities, it's not as easy to find picturesque spots for overnight camping. So when we visited Quebec City, we were thankful for a Walmart that allowed us to park there overnight. We weren't the only ones. We ran into fellow boondockers at this tourist information center, another good spot for spending the night. The final night of our trip, we stayed in Gatineau, just across the river from Ottawa. This parking lot was going to be our sleep spot, but it turned out to be quite noisy so we moved over to another lot down the road, away from busy traffic. If you'd like more details on any of the boondock spots, I'll leave a link to that in the description below. My next video will be an overview of all the places we visited on our two-week trip. Quebec is absolutely beautiful. In the meantime, Alex has been uploading his drone videos of many of the places we stopped at. You can check them out on our channel. Thanks for watching and see you next time!